Houston, say again, please. All right, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there, folks. Welcome you all to part 18 of Titan Quest on the Xbox Series X. Let's crack straight in. We are exactly where we were at the end of part 17. Yeah, we do have a fairly full inventory. I think we've got a bit of space left, though. Hmm, maybe not, actually. <laughs> Could have done with a bit of a trip back. Couldn't we, really? Uh, can we teleport? Yeah, we can. I and mean, it's bugging me as well that I've not got the bloody Athens quest finished off for the lost... What do you call them? I'm going to go back to Athens and see. Just have one last look and see if we can find the dam. It was the Lost Spartans. We've actually found them, but we couldn't find the person to tell. Hail, warrior! Uh, what? Where did I get that from? Hang on a minute. What the hell's going on here? I've picked up something called Frostbite. Wait, no, that's my... I was going to say. <laughs> I keep doing that. I keep looking at the wrong... thing. Yeah, that's a mallet of dexterity. Why Why was I confused there when I went in to sell it? Alright, get rid of that. Yeah, show me what I've got on. That's why I got confused. Good grief. Yeah, it was quite. Uh, it's only a level three, but it's got decent damage on it. That spear. Not as, I mean, we're better off with what we've got. But Killing Hasta. It's got 48 armor on it. Really. I think you got a strength up a bit. Starting to pick up things that want 159 strength. Well, another overburdened warrior. Well, we've got a pristine plumage of which. Do we have any others? We've got one of five. It's a pity you can't mix those in the. So long then! Poison resistance, yeah. A caravan is what you need, eh? So we've got three of these formulas now. And they're all artifacts, yeah. So it must be the only way to get an artifact. You get some really good stuff off it, though. And that's uh, Bat Fang completed, Venom Sack completed, and S and Valor of... Yeah. I think we've got some of those. Bat Fang and Venom Snack. Uh, Venom Snack, a sack, even. That's a Windskin one. A Bowstring. Achilles, Flame. Yeah, maybe not then. Right, we've got two of five venom sack. We've got three of five, yeah. So we need bat fangs and venom sacks. For that one anyway. And 
boar hide and golden fleece and venom sack and demon's blood. So, yeah, we've already got one of. All oh, right, it tells us actually. Do it actually tells us if we've got them in the stocks. So we've got one of the three. It's got venom sack and demon's blood. We need for those. I mean, that comes with 24 poison damage over 3 seconds, 7% physical resistance, 15% vitality damage. If I'd, if I'd figured this out much earlier, I wouldn't have put... I wouldn't have wasted this stuff in the weapons, to be honest. Um, we did have... quite a few things with... Uh, that's a flame one. I thought I put a poison one on a weapon at one point. Probably sold the weapon, though. Anyway, enough of that. I wish you could get a little pointer to where these bloody backers are with the bloody exclamation mark so I can hand this quest in. Oh, muse. But we went round the houses with it last time. I thought it was going to be him. The order, yes. I think you would these secrets and mysteries. You should be getting on to Crete now, don't you? Th you should be getting on to Crete now, don't you think? Well, how much General Leonidas does yeah. not There should be somebody out here that I can hand this into. It's XP if nothing else. Bring word that they've that they're alive and on their way back to their troop. I wonder if it's where I fought the big fella. The, the, you know when we bought the big. Uh, no, because that was a separate question. It's own, wasn't it? <sighs> this was part of the problem as well, wasn't it? It was a Fecking. I'll need to remember that we've got a, a portal open already, so we don't want to portal back on forward. That's where the big fella was, I think, that bit there. A yellow marker in that field, but it doesn't look like an exclamation mark. Oh, that's them, though, isn't it? That's them in the actual bog. It's a shrine. Yeah, I'm totally confused as to where the hell I'm meant to hand that in. Hmm, there's a two guys over here. Anyway, one way or the other. If we do want to check out that bit again, it's over here. Oh, for fuck's sake. I feel like I'm going to walk into uh, this bloody graveyard. Yeah, mortuary. Uh, that's not what I was thinking it was, actually. 
That's not what I was thinking it was at all. Yeah, that's the place I was thinking of there. Fucking miles away. <laughs> I mean, this just proves that I've never reloaded this game. Look at the, 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 the stuff that's not come back to life. I already regret doing this, you know. <laughs> it's like, I feel like I'm nowhere near where I'm meant to be going. It's probably someone stood in Athens waiting for me to speak to them, but I couldn't find anyone with an exclamation mark on them. Yes. Yes. That's the guy I was thinking of. You were in the swamp? You saw them? Oh, good. I was afraid they might have run into trouble in there. Spartans lost. Thank you. 4,000 XP. Right, I'm at, my mind is at peace now. <laughs> it was the last thing we had. Uh, well, Undead Tyrant, but that's in the new area that we're in. Right, we can't teleport back. We're going to have to run it. Let's go. Watch me get lost on the way back now. I'm going to attempt to use the same route exactly, otherwise I might get caught in a maze, people, in a maze. God damn it. God damn you. Monster encampment. I... Not doing too bad for me, actually. That's me hexed it now. The long and winding road back to Athens. Fucking what? It's quite clearly broken. You should be letting me through. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Is it around the other side? That must be ours, surely, now. That's the wall. There we go. Well, it could have been more painful. Not too bad. I think we'll touch touch the birth shrine. Touch the birth shrine. Because we don't like it. Look how close we are to level 18, people. What the shit? Right, I'm glad I did it now. Meanwhile, back in Kanonar's South House.
Mm, fight! Ooh, this level up's going to happen sooner rather than later, isn't it? What the? <laughs> Bit of rubber banding there, people. Another green staff. Christ's sake. Oh, could not be closer to a level up there. It's gonna pop, people! It's gonna pop! Here we go. Woohoo! Level up and ride your pony! Level 18! Let's be having ya! Right, let's back down the hill for a sec. So... Yeah, we're starting to feel a little bit low on the old... Yeah, seems to have lost a bit of strength somewhere down the line, don't we? Better get that up a bit. One, six, one. Seems reasonable. That does a bit of damage for us, doesn't it? Whoa, the exciting bit. Right, so we've got... We're up to 10 on each, aren't we? So that's fine. And... I can't even remember what I did last time now. I'm pretty sure it was a little bit of... Each. So Warwind, we've got up to 3 of 8. That's right, yeah, because I've got the physical damage down on it, didn't I? The next one down is going to do minus 7 physical damage. Instead of minus 14. We're not doing anything with that. That's the main offensive ability. Offensive ability. Offensive ability modifies your chance to hit and ability to critical hit. Right, yeah. Pretty, pretty important, aren't they? So we haven't got that maxed up, maxed out yet. And it also gets our attack speed up as well across the board. Oh, that was our net. Yeah, we we're getting our net damage up because it was superb. And I think we took, yeah, we took a bow one as well to speed that up. Crushing blow provides a chance for attacks to cause bonus damage while in battle rage. All oh, right, battle rage actually does damage as well. Right, come on, Steve. Uh, Warhorn. It's more the radius and the... Right, I think I might actually... I might actually invest in this passive one here, you know. Could do three in there. I mean, that offensive ability is jumping pretty highly each time. We're on 94, that brings it to 126. Then 158. And then... 190. Christ, it's a big jump, isn't it? Uh, it's also taken us from 8% attack speed, plus 8% attack speed, to 
plus 14% attack speed on that. So I might go for that, you know. I might try and max this out. Let's do it. Hey, where are we going? The only way we can. Ahead. Oh yeah, that feels nicer. Yeah. Feeling that speed attack difference on that melee without any shadow of a doubt. Cave up that way. Just saw a red bead on the map. Let's try up there before we come down to that bridge. Well, it's a tomb of some description. Ancient tomb, originally named. Gorgons. A green curious, I think. All right. At least I think it is. <laughs> it does seem to be Sentinel's curious, 40 armor, plus four strength, plus 23 offensive ability, and plus 24 defensive ability. It's pretty decent, isn't it? In fact, well, take the monster monster part aside, which I put into that. We could actually have double the defensive ability if we were to get that monster charm into the Curus. As it happens, we'd be replacing the 25 with a 24 defensive ability. We'd be losing the bleeding resistance. And gaining offensive ability and losing some armor. Until such time as I get the... I wonder what it looks like. Hang on a minute, am I being stupid again? Is this a helm and not a... I think it is, you know. No, that's it there. So it has got more armor on it. Although we're getting... Um, yeah, we'll be losing... Oh, Christ. My strength's dropping like mad, isn't it? <laughs> the, the strength I've just put back is going to drop again. 161, yeah. It's a level 8, though. Uh, no, the one we're about to pick up is a level 3. The one we've got on is a level 8. Hmm. I don't know what the best one is in that particular instance. It doesn't quite look like a, a green it is, though. It just must be the way the text is written. 
Hmm. All right, I'm going to hang on to it. We'll have a look and see what it looks like on. I say. It's a bit sexy. So, got a bit of the old Madonnas going on with the <laughs> with the chess piece. Yeah, I mean, if we put that Boarhide armor into... Uh, sorry, that completed monster charm into there. That would definitely be a better piece of kit. But as it is, we're losing 8 strength. On top of losing everything else that's in there. Although we're gaining defensive ability in return. Well, I'm going to hang on to it for now. Keep going. Oh, a green ring. Holy shite. Have a look at that. Oh. Slightly underwhelming. <laughs> Plus 7% strength. Uh, well, maybe not. Plus 7% strength is... Plus 7% on top of whatever our 161 is. Uh, what have we got in our rings at the minute? Fire resistance and defensibility and cold resistance and energy regen. Um, it's a level 11 ring, that hardy ring. I think, I feel like uh, we could lose some cold, but we still have 10% cold resistance. See what difference it makes to the strength. So we've got 161 at the minute. Yeah. It takes it up another 10, doesn't it? It's another... So it takes us up to 172. Decent. Because if I do put that armour on, that's has got that back. <coughs> <coughs> Blimey, it's dusty in this tomb, people. Good grief. Yeah, so that would take us down to 160. Uh, no, because we'll get another plus 4 on there. So that would take us to 164. If we were to put that on now. Stick with it, Steve. Stick with your plan at the minute. Ornamented leggings. <laughs> That's amazing, that. Put them all to sleep and then... Do the whirlwind strike on him. The pupils loop. Loopity loop.
Doesn't seem to have heard any music for a while. Oh, fucking hell, who are these? She's going down. Ooh, Gorgon's Cuffs of Reasoning, is it? Uh, somewhere. 28 arm, yeah, not very good, are they? Sanguine Straight Bow of Brawn. It does seem to have been a huge circle I've done that. And I missed a bit right at the top, whether it's a whole room or whether it's to another place is yet to be decided, people. Ooh, hello. Looks like a bit of a boss fight, doesn't it? Run! Fucking hell. <laughs> You're dead, mate, you are. Undead tyrant done. Well, I nearly missed all of that, but I <laughs> hadn't checked the map. Nearly at 500,000. Ornamented leggings are not as good as what I've got on. Uh, sturdy wraith cage, nope. Buckler, nope. Ornamented leggings of the hunt. Uh, what? They're a green. Don't remember picking them up. They're a major one, though, aren't they? Yeah, 100 intelligence. Yeah, I could pretty much sell all of this. Oh, it's a beautiful sunshine. Knossos! <clears throat> we still have some potions? Those always come in handy. Yes, let me sell you my wares. Well, that is of no. Oh, well, hang on. No, they're not of any use.
The ruined stuff of foresight. Yeah, I generally hang on to my greens, but I don't know if I've got a huge amount of space. My money, however, is not far away from having enough to extend my storage. Well, we've just gone over it as it happens. So long. Got some coin building up to do after this. It doesn't actually say how much it's extending it by, though, does it? Also, not overly sure I need half of this stuff anymore. Um, I feel like I might hang on to my coin at the minute. Good start and transfer. Well, that's a green, that's a green, and that's a green, and that's a blue. I feel like we could get rid of some of the bucklers. Uh, I've kept them for health regeneration reasons and possibly getting charms off them reasons. So... Well, I'm not going to put that back on, am I? The block's nowhere near as good as my blue. Get rid of those. Uh, movement speed we don't need because we've now got better ones than those. That was this. I was hanging on to that helm because it's my regen helm. Uh, uh, it's only a little bit better than the one we've got, though, isn't it? It's the monster charm that's on it. I think that's why I've kept it. Corinthian helm of reasoning is a yellow. Why well, I've kept that? Oh, it must have been for the intelligence. Uh, we're going to get rid of those. Uh, no, they're green, so I'll hang on to those. Blue, I'll hang on to those. Can probably get rid of that sword now. Ah, it was the monster charm, wasn't it? Life leech. Bat bang! Well, we can get rid of that bow now. And probably that Sudis, and probably that Gladius. Brain Cleaver was hanging on to. Yeah, I think the only one. Yeah, that's a yellow. Don't really need that, do we? Cyclops Club of Necromancy. Let's get rid of it. Right, well, uh, that's a yellow, isn't it? Oh, it's the charm. Right, okay. Well, I mean, that's given us half of it back, so I think I'll hang on to my coin for now, to be fair. And we'll store that. Come again! And this will give us even more coin. Come in. Oh, didn't put my, didn't put my, uh, armor that I want to keep in there, did I? I feel like if I could get the... Yeah. 12 strength. I mean, it's a lot of strength to lose, isn't it? Uh, 
8 strength, but it'll give us an extra 8 armour. Plus the offensive and defensive abilities. Uh, double the defensive ability, actually, yeah. So, completed. Ch mm, so, that's a completed monster charm of Boarhide, isn't it? Good Come luck. again! Which one of those charms needed Boarhide? Have something to store? Their formulas, I should say. Yeah, it was that one. Oh, we've got a completed charm of Boarhide. Oh, no. It's asking for a completed hide, so we don't have one. So we could just keep collecting for that at the minute. All right. Mm. Where's Lightning Guy? There he is. Oh yes, and uh, how can I help you? Well, oh, thirty thousand is not too bad. Thought it was going to be some sort of ridiculous amount. Yeah, we are going to lose the item though. But it's, uh, it's no, there's nothing special about it really, is there? It's not, a, it's not a green or a blue or anything. Zeus protect you. Marvelous. Right, we can put that on. Our armor. Well, that or it's going to tell us we've got we've got it for our charm. Yeah, there you go, boar hide. Essence of the golden fleece. Complete relic. Yeah, but we don't have scroll of the breaking wheel anyway, so we couldn't make that even if we wanted to. So boar hide for those is kind of pointless at the minute. So that's fine. Turtle shell, that one. Goodbye. What can we put on Goodbye. armor? Just try to remember what things we can put on the chest pieces. Enhance all armor. That's poison resistance. Yeah, I think I think they are the best ones actually. Goodbye. Yeah, defensive ability, bleeding resistance, five armor. Cool. Actually, we can put that on the helm. Yeah, fucking hell, I forgot about that. We don't actually have to put that on there. We've got helm and we've got cuffs that we can put stuff on as well. Yeah, I think this... Yeah, I, we haven't picked up any more of these because we haven't been fighting the old boars. That's what it is. In theory, we can treble all of that. If it puts the same amount onto those. Nice. There we go. Well, I think that was worth it. Sentinels cure us. So yeah, it's brought our strength down a bit, but happy with that. With the extra defensive. Our defensive ability is at 244 now. Offensive is at 384. Right, let's go. Uh, have we sold everything we need to? Yarp. And we're perfectly okay for health potions. Nice. We've got ourselves a green outfit, people. I feel like I'd be inclined to put a different colour on now that the red's showing through so much on the outfit. The white might look quite cool. You shall not pass! <laughs> I can't help myself, people. Karatos Bluff. Oh, 
or Kratos Bluff, one or the other. Well, covered quite a lot of ground in this one as well. Forty-five minutes in, blimey. Celebrate with a super sprite, I think. And no, I'm not sponsored by Sprite. I'm not anywhere near big enough to be sponsored by anybody, people. <laughs> I love a 7-Up as much as I love a Sprite. In fact, I prefer 7-Up. No, I'm not sponsored by 7-Up. <laughs> Smouldering hunting spear. Hello, we get. It's the bracelet of life that I won't put on. How can a bracelet of life regenerate energy? What's that all about? Oh, because they've got health in them. Okay. I think. So we're going to say it together. You shall not pass. Oh, hello. Hello, good sir. What are you doing trading all the way in these parts? Oles or Oles. Enchantment. Enchantment. Yes. Oh, hello, he's got a green double axe. Tainted double axe of reckless power. <laughs> Plus 30% physical damage, 16.5. Uh, that's weird. Why is it not... Um... Good day. Oh, no. What's happened to my weapon? What? Why is my weapon not equipped? What's happened? Did somebody use something to knock it out of my hand and I've picked it back up? What was that all about? What the shit happened there? Alright, let me know in the comments below what the holy shit fire just happened there, people. Forgot something. Uh. Well, my, oh, Jesus, this is worth a lot of money. It's 200 grand. Mine's better, I think. I think I'd rather have me frost than, me, than his poison. Oh, he's got some... Uh, 
scrolls oh scroll of the breaking wheel that's what we need to one of the, we need one of those to make our thingamajobber I'm gonna buy one for all the money that it is scroll of the storm which is well, I'm half tempted to buy one of each because we might need it to make charms. Scroll of the arcane power. They all seem to be 50... Oh, no, they're 30 and 40 grand. Jesus. Sends a blast of bitter cold air out of blah, blah, blah. Well, we've got the money to buy them. Should we just buy them so we've got them? And that way, if we need to make charms later, we've got them, haven't we? Still got 400 grand, pretty much. Ooh, yeah. I'm tempted to change the uh, colour of her tarp. I feel like that red coming through is the colour of the dye that we bought. Interestingly, they don't seem to have a white one here. <laughs> is that it there? No, that's grey. The grey Greek outfit. Burgundy Greek outfit. Gold! Gold and burgundy seem to be the uh, most expensive. I don't know. No, they're not actually. 6,000 for the slate. Oh, that's rose. 12,000 for purple Greek outfit. What the shit? Not a massive purple fan, to be fair, but I feel like I have to have it because it's the best one there. <laughs> uh, oh, that was slate Greek outfit. Yeah. So long. Well, that was just a waste of coin. <laughs> just spoiling myself. Right, that's uh, gold. And that's the slate. Yeah, but it annoys me you can't try it to see how good it is before you you waste it sort of thing. Burgundy. Ah, yeah. It's quite... It's a bit deeper, isn't it? The red. Uh, which one am I most likely to stick with? The gold or the slate? The slate was the more expensive. That's quite cool, though, isn't it? Gerald. If I change it to slate now and I don't like it, I'm going to be annoyed. <laughs> Mind you, that green seems to work really well with the gold, doesn't it? Should we leave it with gold? Yeah, I quite like that. Leave it at that for now. Does he stock back up with his dyes or not? He does not. He maybe does after a certain length of time, but he certainly does it straight away. Good luck! Hey, which way? Very, very, very curious to see where we end up after Greece. No spoilers, unless it is the end after Greece. <laughs> and then just tell me. <laughs> but don't tell me if it's... Uh, don't tell me in the comments. I want it to be a nice surprise when it happens. Bit, in fact, maybe I'll, I might well be there, to be fair, by the time you see me ask that question. Or hear me ask that question. Some sort of villa in the mountains. Ugh.
Go the other way. Light the braziers, light the braziers, because we don't like it. Ooh, Knossos' palace. Yes, hang on, let me type me notes in, mate, before you start fighting me. Foul beast! Fight! Nice. Took care of their sad asses, didn't I? And I didn't even use the Shrine of Experience, which was a bit silly. <laughs> I didn't think, I just said, fight! Run, run! Fucking hell. Health regen seems to come back quite swiftly there. Not sure what that was all about. Maybe it was one of those uh, boons I get from having Berserk on or something. Agility. Oh, it's dexterity. I was going to say, I hadn't seen speed on a ring before. Holy shit. <laughs> that was brilliant. I really enjoyed that, people. Yeah, I'm wondering if the the lack of music during the battles and stuff is because I haven't sort of reloaded the game for a while. I wonder if it's got a little bit confused. I've not heard music for a fair while, unless my brain is playing tricks on me and I haven't. It's just passed me by. Oh, hello. Who are these guys? Fucking hell. I didn't realise he was quite as high in health as he was. Need more energy. He's going down. Goodbye, sir. A heavy Falcata, seriously, after all that. New enemy type, though. It's quite nice to see. Mechanical enemies. I 
like a pro. Ooh, hit the hour mark. Just a bit. <laughs> Took most of them out by the time they'd woken up. down with my spinning attack, thank you. Helms of dexterity and all sorts, they usually just got uh, dex on them and stuff, yeah. potion used though, it's pretty sweet. Love this outfit. I'm glad I put the gold on it now. Looks way better. He's a big fella, isn't he? Jesus Christy. Court of King Minos. All right. Well. could start something here that uh, I'm going to have to see through if I carry on. Unless it's going to be kind of give me a rebirth shrine, but that looks like a uh, Minoan Labyrinth. feel like perhaps we should uh, save this for the next part. Yeah, so it's going to be a long and winding 
little area of that, I think. The problem is, well, I can leave it loaded up right enough. Oh, the music kicked in. I noticed the music kick in there. Yes, thank you. So, we could leave it there. I probably won't record it immediately after this, so I'll just leave it on the quick resume. And if quick resume doesn't work, there'll be the rebirth shrine that was at the beginning of the area, I suppose. Uh, I'm pretty sure we didn't miss anything, so... I say that all the time, though, and then I have. But there's most definitely hasn't been a, a waypoint or anything kicking around these parts. Yes, okay. Right, well, I will... Oh, hello. This is an undiscovered bit, though. So I look at this. Metal guys down the bottom. Ooh, ornament best plate of sucker. Eh, sucker! Can you dig it, sucker? <laughs> Just got me armor the way I want it, and now I've picked up an armor. I think. Yeah, I have. Uh, 33 armor, though, as opposed to 40 that's on this one. And 4% chance of 90% physical resistance. No. I don't think so. I don't think so. That is not better than what I'm wearing, sir. Yeah, I must have just ran round. Somehow missed them. I'm not sure how, but I did broken statue there. Right. Right, okay. Just a little bit we missed there. Seems reasonable. See, the game said game saved there. I mean, I'm not overly sure what... <laughs> what that means so far as I guess it will save what I've done but it won't save exactly where I am because it will just put me back where the rebirth shrine was of which I can't remember um, the shrines are orange oh there's one there's one there wasn't there just as we came in oh no that's the braziers and that was a uh, a standard shrine, not a rebirth shrine. It doesn't actually tell you where the rebirth shrines are on that, does it? On the key. I think that might be one there, just above the Y. So, end of the day, if it's if we only have to run through the area again if it did happen to need reloaded. But as I say, I'll I'll use the. Uh, I'll use the quick resume. And hopefully we'll do. Which is pretty much what I've done for the last... Well, as I say, I hadn't uh, I hadn't played this for the best part of a week. Well, uh, yeah, maybe five days. So, and it loaded up just fine. So it's absolutely brilliant, that, that quick resume. I'm loving the kit we've got on at the minute. It looks superb, doesn't she? It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you once again in Titan Quest on the Xbox Series X. And I'll catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.